Son of a... I guess I'll post to Twitter, why not? Alright, luckily I still have the energy to stream. This is just a post birthday stream. Neat. Thank you, Ren, for the one bit. Thank you for the happy birthdays. Hope all's well with you, man. I just finished my birthday celebrations with my family. So I decided, you know, I should probably stream just a little bit. Happy birthday, bitch cock. Thank you, man. Again, the chat's off center. Professional streamer, by the way, chat. Been streaming for four years, by the way. Vagina, happy birthday, vagina. Thank you for the 12 bits, Kuna, of unfunny message. Thank you, man. Yeah, I just wanted to share a little bit of... Uh, like what happened on the birthday stuff? I thought you died. No. Would you for your birthday? I got a lot of money. I was worried. No, I didn't die. I mean, given how I typed in the Discord, you can pretty much assume I'm not dead. Sup, Kuna? I got a bunch of money for my birthday. I got some bow ties. I got some slacks. And that's really it. Yeah, I got bow ties, slacks, and money. Neat. Sam Mink is super stupid and he likes Alec. Yeah, true, he does like Alec. That's, that's very true. Thank you for the one bit, Kuna. Also, but we went bowling, and I want to share with you the, the, the three bowling games that we did. And I want to show you my uprise as the underdog of the bowling games. I played three games of, of bowling. Unfortunately, I didn't take a picture of the scorecard. On the second game because it, it really didn't count Neat. but i'll show you do you come in the bowling ball did you come in the bowling ball no i didn't given how i was with my family that's not something i want to do uh let me see which one is it this one okay this is the first game i did and as you can see, I blocked out the names because I don't want to leak the names of my family members. But in the, but okay, yeah, the the top Neat. score. Level five got Riz Livy done rizzing up baby Gronk guy spice. What the dog do in skibidi toilet in real life only you know. I don't have a mute. I don't have a mute donation thing. God damn it! I used to have one. Smoking dank on the Oppenheimer among us. Anyway. Pizza on guy. Yeah, the the top row that's my score. The middle one is my grandfather, and the bottom one is my. Is my grandmother. Uh, it, it's been a while since, since I was since I've been bowling. Even though bowling is like one of my favorite sports ever. What's up, Lana? Yeah, thank you, Kuna. I'm trying to actually like do something. But thank you for the bit. It is fun indeed. That's why I went. It, I, I'm super rusty when it comes to bowling. Even though it's my favorite thing ever, my favorite hobby. So I scored a 71. I got second place. The second row was my grandfather. It's been like seven years since he's bowled, but he did pretty all right after like, you know, picking it up a while. And then my grandmother was on the bottom. Yeah, she did pretty good. My grandmother is so like so into bowling. She has her own custom bowling ball that she's had for like decades. That's how like into bowling she is. And that's where I got my fascination with bowling from. It's from her. Yeah, she yeah, she destroyed us in this first game. Because I was still trying to perfect my technique, or I was trying to remember my bowling technique. It took me a while. 
and then I had to like change it up sometimes. So yeah, for, for the first game, went to her, I lost it. In the second game, I didn't take a picture of it, because it, it wasn't really a game. Uh, some of my family members were out, like getting food or at the bar or whatever, so they were preoccupied. And since it was my birthday, I bowled on their turns, on their frames. I want to order some Daldos. How much are they? They're, they're currently sold out, but they'll be back on the site soon. We'll be restocking on some Daldos very soon. Thank you for asking. Um, yeah, so since some, some of my family members were at the bar, I bowled on their turn. So I was playing for, for, two, for two rows. It was mostly just for me to like practice and like perfect my technique. It, it, it was me against my grandfather. But at the end of all of it, even the average score of my two like games I played, I was still a few points under him. <laughs> That's either how good he performed or how bad I was. But I was only a few points even on average. And then lastly, the third game. We had one more game. And this is where I shined as the birthday boy underdog. Here it is. Yeah, okay, this is the third and final game we played. The top row is me. Middle is grandfather, but this time on the bottom is my father. To where I picked up... From my grandmother, I picked up the interest of bowling. But my father, I picked up the mechanics of bowling. Because he, he's competitive as well. The competitiveness, run, competitiveness runs in the family. Specifically with bowling. Again, that's where I get it from. So yeah, this time my father played, but... Unfortunately for him, he played bowling with his company only a couple days beforehand. They went out to like some kind of like, you know, like trip, or whatever, or like, you know, company fun time. They went bowling. So he, he, because he's old, my father, he was still sore from that bowling. And then we did bowling again on my birthday. Didn't get to wait till, it was, till I was done streaming. Yeah. Sorry. What's up, Seth? So luckily, my father was handicapped, which probably contributed to my, you know, winning the game, but I still won, nonetheless. On this third and final game, I finally perfected my technique. I essentially had it down most of the times. That's why I got a strike here, and like some eights and fives. Happy birthday as well. Thank you, Seth. Proud of you. Thank you, Lana. It, it took some time. Um... Also in the middle, uh, my grandfather, he, he still kept up the, the pace. He got some gutter balls, a lot of gutter balls, but an occasional strike, a nine, some sevens. Yeah, bowling can be hard, but luckily, since I'm still young, I don't have any soreness. The only real kind of pain I kind of do have is like on my foot, on my left foot a little bit, but it's all right. But luckily, I came out clutch at the very end on the last game. I got 118 points, blowing out my competition out the water. Like, it's like the birthday energy came to me and boosted up my bowling skills. It was nice. And then we also ate at the place. We got like a platter tray of like chicken fingers and french fries and cheesy bread or something. Looks so like you guys went bowling after y'all were done masturbating. Yep. I've discovered that Mystery Line is just the worst. But right, speaking of which, Lana, I saw that you got a new, you placed a new world record for Bowser Land. Congratulations. You beat up my time by like a minute and some seconds. Good job. Proud of you. Uh, yeah, that was there for the bowling. And then all of us came back home. We had chocolate cake. Triple chocolate cake, to be specifically. I was planning on... Yeah, Horrorland is also kind of bad. I, 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 I don't like Horrorland. I've been stuck for two months. Welcome to the club, Safranak. Welcome to the club. Everyone had a 53-minute Mystery Land. I was very happy to bring it back. Nice. Good job. You earned that world record. Um, yeah, and then all of us came back home. We ate, we ate some triple chocolate cake. Uh, what's, what's even funnier... It, we all gathered in the kitchen to sing, and my family sing happy birthday to me. My mother was recording, you know, all of them singing happy birthday to me. But when she was done recording, I think she was, like, recording on, like, Snapchat or whatever. 
when she went to finalize the the video, she accidentally deleted it. <laughs> the the recording of all, of all of us singing "Happy Birthday." So she actually asked us, "Can we sing it again?" <laughs> like I, I do, I do a take two. And I was like, "Okay, sure." So so we put the candles back in. We relit the candles. Everyone's saying "Happy Birthday" again, and then she got the video. It, it was like a literal, you know, like film production set. All right, people, take two, take two. But then we ate the cake, and it was delicious. Yeah, and that was my birthday. It was pretty good. Hope all of you had a great day today. Hopefully you didn't miss me. And no, I'm not dead. As per usual. Whenever I type in the Discord, you can assume I'm not dead. Assume. Missed you. I missed you too. But like beforehand, I was still catching up on editing. I think I have like a sort of new video format for the YouTube videos now. And still, I'm, I'm right now like in the middle of really questioning, do I want to continue Mario Party? I'm considering just throwing out my entire built up identity as a Mario Party runner. Breaks are nice though. Yeah, they're really nice. I just, uh, I did, all I did was just sit back, worked on videos. I watched Jujutsu Kaisen. Read some books. It was nice. But do Mario Party, Paper Mario, and SM64. The thing is, though, uh, like I wanted to part from Mario Party, but not anything similar. So I'll, I'll be entirely just like disregarding my Mario Party viewers. People who only watch me for Mario Party, I'll just be entirely disregarding them. Because I want to do so many other different things. Do the dating sim game? What do you mean the dating sim game? Which one are you referring to? Because I already played one and I lost. The girl rejected me, so... I guess I'm dying a virgin. Oh. I mean, well, I can still try to get that girl back. If I really tried. <laughs> you practice? Uh, I guess so, maybe. What time is it? It's it's already getting late. I just wanted to do like a short stream, just like to actually stream again and talk about the day. I say this and have no boyfriend. Well, you just gotta practice, Lana. You play that dating sim game, and then you can learn, like, like you learn, learn all the lessons, but then just do the opposite of them, so you can apply it to men. I'm pretty sure that's how it works. Harvest Moon, isn't that like an Animal Crossing knockoff? I mean, I want to know. I've never played Animal Crossing or Harvest Moon. It has marriage in it? Oh, cool. Maybe I'll play it one day. Um, yeah, that was actually, I just wanted to stream again. Talk to the people. Yeah, but I'll be, um, I'll stream tomorrow. But if it makes you happy, I'll watch, and so will others. I guess so. It's, at least the bare minimum, I need to have fun when I stream. Because if, if I'm having fun, then the fun energy will radiate to chat. But to, to all of you who, who ask for Mario Party and like only watch for Mario Party, just know that that may be dying down. I'm getting tired of Mario Party. I want to do other interesting, fun stuff. Like, things that are objectively more fun than Mario Party. I actually want to do that, so... If you do leave, hopefully you find another stream that's entertaining. If you stick around, then thank you. Hope you enjoy the, the new content. Yeah, thanks. Yeah. That's it, everyone. Um, have a good rest of your mornings, afternoons, and evenings. Anyone live? Oh, you video games is live. All right. Yeah. Sorry, I've been gone for a while. Just you know, stuff. All right. And that's that.